So there we go. Uh, so I'm outside and I'm going to be painting um, my Range Rover. So I did select a couple different colors. So there's my Team Raffi Range Rover. And I'm going to start painting some colors and some panels will be different colors as if it's a door that was taken off somebody else's truck and the hood's going to be different color. So anyways, let's start painting. So here are my three colors that I chose to paint the car. So this is the first coat. So all these panels are going to be the uh, pearl light blue. And then the hood's going to be pearl white. And the two doors and the rear door is actually going to be pearl green. So first coat is on. Now I just got to wait for it to dry a bit. And then I'll be putting on a second coat real quick. The joy of painting outside. Oh well. I'll have to fix that. There we go. Donor door, donor doors from another truck. Ha ha ha, same truck. This is supposed to be um, kind of a pearl light blue, but it looks a lot like a gray. So looks like I might have to put another can uh, onto the main body so it looks more like a blue. Because you can tell here just freshly painted it's a little bit more blue I guess the paint is thicker I did put a black um, primer on it maybe that's why it's a little darker so I'll have to go thicker so I'll have to get another can of the pearl blue for the main body color and then I'll be putting bodywork patches on this all over the place so all the doors coming from another truck that's what I'm gonna go the rear door and the two doors and the hood is actually a different color because it comes from a different truck. And I left the interior of the gate at the back black and the grill might stay black. I'm going to check a couple things and those are the skid plate for underneath. I don't have to paint those. They'll stay black. And that's pretty much what I got done so far. So now I got to start putting it together. Well, get another can for that and um, finishing it off and put it all together and let me tell you there's a lot of screws to put on this thing and the screws are tiny so that's the little leftovers all the little gadgets that has to go onto the body and here are the main posts that holds the whole body together i left those black and then we have little tiny hinges with little tiny screws. There's a lot of tiny parts for this. And then we have the front grill, the light buckets and the lights. So lots, lots, lots of parts. Anyways, next step is going to be putting it all together once I do the second, well, third coat or fourth coat onto the main body part. And then we'll have to take my compressor and the airbrush out and do some uh, Bondo work on it. And then sand it down with some uh, paper, uh, wet, wet sandpaper, to make it look like um, this thing is in the body shop. So thanks for watching, guys, and uh, leave a thumbs up. And um, don't forget... Keep those batteries charged and go out there and have some fun and go break something. Because if you're not breaking anything, you're not having any fun. Talk to you guys later. Bye.